I'm Ajay Gupta. I'm a pediatric oncologist at Roswell Park Comprehensive Cancer Center. Clinical trials are the basis upon which modern therapy has evolved. And so everything that we know about and everything that we use to treat cancer has come from a clinical trial. A clinical trial can involve a drug or an intervention or a non-intervention, so it can be exercise or a new app or even different kind of surgery. And what a clinical trial does is it tries to see if this is going to be an improvement on what exists already. Trials can be used at any point in your therapy and often they can be used up front if we're trying to compare it to the standard of care. Safety is top priority. So we make sure that the trials are thoroughly reviewed by something called an IRB or Institutional Review Board. And informed consent is a document put out by the IRB or the institutional officials who approve the study to make sure that the participants of the study understand everything that there is to know about the trial. That includes the safety aspects, the risks, the benefits, and anything else that might be pertinent. It's important to emphasize that clinical trials are always voluntary, and at any point you feel uncomfortable or don't want to be a part of a trial, you can always stop. There's an incredible opportunity here at Roswell in that our researchers and clinicians work really closely together. This makes basic science research really easily brought to the bedside. And so that makes different treatments and opportunities that may not be available anywhere else in the U.S. available here in Buffalo. Even if a trial doesn't personally benefit you, it may still help our researchers in developing a new standard of care in the future. Many participants feel like clinical trials help them learn more about their disease, and they feel like they're a more involved partner with the doctors, and they even feel like they've personally contributed to the advancement of science.